Okay, so today we're testing the fifth floor conventional fire alarm zone for elevator recall. And we're gonna play around a little bit with the sequences and see if it actually recalls the elevator every time with an automatic detection. So here we have the green light representing our elevator recall. We have our fifth floor elevator smoke detector with relay base. We have a fifth floor manual station, conventional, and a fifth floor conventional smoke detector tied into a conventional fire alarm panel. So we're gonna simulate a fire and spray some smoke at our automatic detector. Let's see if our green light comes off, recalling the elevator. And there it is, green lights off, elevator has been recalled. And there's our fire alarm going off with the strobe. Clear the detector. Reset the panel. Now let's try smoke detector down the hallway. That's not set up for recall of the elevator. And there we go, we have our alarm. And as you can see here, the elevator has not been recalled with the smoke detector down the hallway. Our fire alarm's going off. Well, that's an alarm. Let's see if we can recall the elevator with the elevator lobby smoke detector. There's a fire in the elevator lobby, and the elevator is not being recalled. We now have a functioning elevator a completely functioning elevator with a fire. Nothing. Elevator is still in operation. Now we'll reset the panel. Now what happens if we pull the manual station? There we go. We're in alarm. So we pulled the manual station. Elevator has not been recalled, and that's okay because an elevator is not allowed to be recalled by means of manual recall. Now let's say the fire migrates to the elevator lobby. Will the elevator get recalled? Now a fire that's migrated to the elevator lobby and the elevator is not getting recalled because the manual station has been activated, short circuiting the fire alarm conventional zone, not allowing the smoke detector relay base to trip and recall the elevator. The fifth floor elevator relay base smoke detector is now disconnected from the circuit as we have a short circuit at the pull station. What this tells us is on a conventional system, we cannot tie the elevator lobby smoke detector into the existing conventional circuit if we want the elevator lobby smoke detector to recall the elevator. This concludes our video. I hope everybody's learned something here.